So I was approached by the engineering research theme at the EPSRC to co-chair this initiative, Tomorrow's Engineering Research Challenges. And we've had these many different discussions, roundtables, workshops to enable engineers who necessarily need to be specialist in their areas to have a much broader view. Well, engineering research has always been focused on helping society to do better, to solve challenges. And as everybody will know, there are some really big challenges coming up. When we're looking at every pound we spend of UKRI and EPSRC funding, how can we spend it in a way that delivers the very best possible impact on society? The work that we've done has led to high-level priorities. We looked at cross-cutting themes, for example, achieving net zero and sustainability. And then we arrived at eight technological challenges. And the big headlines there are space, transport, materials, engineering for health and well-being, robotics and AI, responsible engineering, nature-based engineering, and what we've called global engineering solutions, by which we mean when engineers in the R&D community address problems and challenges, that the solution should be one that improves the world rather than degrade it. And that is something that is easy to say. It's actually a very, very complex area. What was really interesting was the consistency of message that came from every group. The need to be more inclusive of other perspectives so that we can make sure we're backing and forming collaborations that really make an impact. I want to see a, an engineering sector which is agile, that is responsive, that is right at the forefront of both engineering ideas, engineering solutions, the quality of the research is recognised worldwide as leading. Engineers are motivated everywhere to make a real difference. That's in our DNA, it's in our ethics. And we just need to break the mould a little bit to be more integrated, to be more innovative, to be more inclusive. And then we can really make more of a difference. Less stuck, more progressive.